Hey everyone, Lone Wolf Jedi here, and welcome to yet um, the third in my Holy to Rant series. This one's gonna be on Valentine's Day. Now, um, you'll excuse the background because it's the sun is shining. It's directly right here, and um, I'm out here because I'm out here in, my, in the living room, which is also my sister and my uh, oldest niece's bedroom. Cause I'm keeping an eye on. Well. I got Spear with me right here. But I'm also keeping an eye on the kids. Because lately, let me get them for a moment. <clears throat> Y'all remember AJ, don't you? AJ here. He's basically been trying to have his way with his sister, Dusty. Yeah, you have. Um, also in the background, my nephew is watching some kind of show on TV. Oh, it was on Antenna TV. It's some... It's like some old, old, uh, old black and white show. Um, <clears throat> but anyway. This is going to be on Valentine's Day and how it's gotten fucked up over the years. Now, I'm currently looking also at the uh, Wikipedia article. Let me move my uh, thing over here, over to the side here. I will directly read from it. I'm going to also post a link to it right, right below. Let's see here. St. Valentine's Day commonly known as Valentine's Day, or the Feast of the Valentine, Feast of St. Valentine, is observed on February 14th each year. It is celebrated in many countries around the world, although it remains a working day in most of them. United States included. United States included. St. <coughs> Valentine's Day Day began as a little... Sorry, my, my, uh, some of my pronunciation is not that good. Liturgical, but liturgical. Hopefully, I saw, said that right. Celebration of one or more early Christian saints named Valentinus. The most popular martyr, martyrology associated with Saint Valentine was that he was that he was imprisoned for, for performing weddings for soldiers who were forbidden to marry, and for ministering to Christians. And that's Sally. She's outside right now. Who were persecuted under the Roman Empire. During his imprisonment, he is said to have healed the daughter of his jailer, Asterius. The legend states that before his execution, he wrote for a letter from your valentine as a farewell. Well, I guess that's where that came in. Today, St. Valentine's Day is an official feast day in the Anglican Communion, as well as, the Lutheran, as, well as in the Lutheran Church, the Eastern, Orthodox, the Eastern Orthodox Church also celebrates St. Valentine's Day albeit on July 6th and July 30th. No, I'm not going to do a random video on those, on that because, well, we don't... Around that time we celebrate, uh, around the 6th we celebrate another holiday here in the States. I'll get to that when, I, uh, when, I, when July 6th comes. Or when July 4th comes, which is the date. <coughs> and as for July 30th, I really don't know what happens around then. I mean, other than my sister's 44th birthday, which is the 19th. The former date, in honor of the Roman Predator St. Valentine, and the latter date, in honor of Harold Martyr Valentine, the Bishop of Inter Interomina, on modern termi. Modern termi, that is. The day was his first associated with romantic love in the, in the circle of, of Geoffrey Chaucer in the High Middle Ages, when the tradition of courtly love flourished. By the 15th century, it had evolved into an occasion in which lovers expressed a love for each other by presenting flowers, offering confectionery, and sending green cards, known as Valentines, which is pretty much what it is today. Valentine's Day symbols are used today, are used today, include the, that are used today, are include the heart-shaped outline, doves, and the figure of the one-winged Cupid, or the winged I, God, I can't, can't believe I did that. Here's a Final Fantasy reference there. The winged Cupid. 
Since the 19th century, handwritten valentines have given way to mass-produced greeting cards. So, yeah, I just read a little bit of the article. You can read the whole entire thing when I when you click the link below. So, yeah, it's it started off as a, <coughs> as a celebration of a guy who was in prison for illegal forwarding marriages and, and, and is also in uh, ministering to Christians. Basically, and it evolved into showing love and affection for one another. Now, me personally, I have no reason for this holiday because I don't have I don't have an I don't have a significant other right now. Um, a few years ago, I thought I did, but then she ended up calling me a stalker. Um, now. <clears throat> I'm gonna like I like I do with other ones. I'm gonna go with both ends of this. First of all, I find it a little. My niece put it perfectly this year. My youngest niece put it perfectly earlier today before she left for school. Why do you pick one day a year to show your love and affection for someone when it should be not just one a day a year, but many days throughout the year? I mean. If you love, if you love someone enough, don't do it just once a year. Plain and simple. Um, <clears throat> and don't do it just on holidays either. Do it like spur of the moment. One one like one one day just to say, come on, come on, honey, let's go out to a movie, or let's go get some go get go get go have a nice dinner on me, you know. It doesn't have to be you guys. It can be any. It can be guys taking his girlfriend out. Spirit, what are you doing? Got Spirit coming up to me and giving me a little, uh, showing her Valentine's appreciation. If you know, <laughs> just kidding. Yeah, she she's showing you some affection right now. But um, yeah. It can be guy. If it, 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 it can be just more than like you guys taking your girlfriends out to out to wherever. It can it, girls, ladies. You can take your take your men out to some to some expense to some nice restaurant or a movie. Um, you can uh, at spare claw claw claw. I'll write my leg. <clears throat> I mean, sure, I'm wearing sweats, but. <clears throat> Sure, I'm wearing sweats, but uh, it's just when the claws go into God, give the spirit some lovings here, some att some affection, some attention here. Come here, spirit. But yeah, um, I'll try to think here. Um, the, well, I won't get myself back on track here. Um, or it could be hell with a, with a, with the way things are now. If guys, you can take your 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 um, partner out to a restaurant or movie. Uh, ladies, you can do the same thing. Take your partner to a restaurant. Anybody can do that doesn't have to be just the guy taking the girls out. Like I said, with today's society, with the whole, with the whole gay and lesbian thing, guys can take other guys out. Ladies can take other ladies out. And also, like my, and it's also like my niece, like my youngest niece said, don't just do it on Valentine's Day. Do it any day you can, any day you want. Now for the other end, my, what I consider my end. Hi, Spirit. Spirit wants to be in the video now. She's purring a little bit. But, um, what I consider my end. Guys, ladies, if you don't have another significant other, don't worry about it. This is just a crap holiday anyway. I mean, I believe Archfiend put it best. This is the crappiest holiday there is. And, honestly, I've never seen any reason for it. I mean, 
Now I'm two. Now I'm starting to have two. Now I'm starting to hear up here. Um, basically, ever since well, in, in high school, I had this in middle last year of middle school and high school and throughout high school, there was this one girl that I knew. I treated her as a friend, but in reality, I real I had deeper feelings for her. Unfortunately, it's not going to happen. Nothing's going to happen there. Because a few years after we graduated, she died. Um, but yeah, it, it, it's just a, I see it as a, a worthless holiday. Because one, I don't have a significant other. And two, it's just... And two, it's just, you know, it's, it's, it's useless. And I've already gone on for about 11 minutes about on this. So I'm going to go ahead and end it right now. Um, no spirit, okay? You were getting a little too attention poorish there. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it's a, it's a useless holiday. And uh, I'm sorry to say it, but it's true. So, until my next holiday rant video, which will be on St. Patrick's Day, I'll be having fun with that one. <clears throat> this is a little jazz saying thank you all for waiting. Thank you all for waiting. Thank you all for watching. And I'll see you all next time. Take care of yourselves. You think you know me?